Hello, you beautiful humans! Welcome to my guide to abusing Agris points. Or just, I found something out a couple of weeks ago that I feel like a bunch of people don't know and it might help you out, especially if you go AFK for days upon days upon days or you are too casual and you play just Genshin too much and you don't have time to burn your Agris points, like myself. Basically, here's how it goes. Everyone knows that you get 20,000 Agris points every single day once the Agris point refresh comes. 20,000 points daily, if you completed your journals. That's common knowledge. What is also common knowledge is that you only get those points assigned to you after you change characters or you re-log into the game. If you don't do that, you are not going to be assigned the new 20,000 points. That's common knowledge. What people might not know is that you are assigned all of the Agris points from all of the missing days once you change characters or relog. So, for example, if you go AFK for 3 days on the same character without logging off, let's say you are AFK training on dummies like I did, then when you change characters you will get 60,000 points, not 20,000 points. I found this out by basically AFKing for 3 days, then I went to Thornwood, I was sitting on almost maxed out Agris points, then I spent 1 hour grinding, after one hour, I was down to about 30,000 Agris. Then I changed characters to my Ranger, my Life Skiller. I was assigned 60,000 points and I was sitting again on 90,000. That's it. That's basically it. If you want to, pl if you plan to AFK for five days or something like that, this might help you out. You know, it's a way to maximize, to not waste points. Everyone kind of knows that if you hit 100,000, you are wasting the points, but there you go, just AFK on the grinding character and that's pretty much all you have to do if you want to be AFK for that much time. So thanks for watching, hope this was helpful, see you next time and uh, yeah, bye bye.